Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for October the 22nd of 2020. Well, it is titled tagging Bennu. So what do we see here? Well, this is an image of a portion of the Osiris Rex spacecraft. And what happened just two days ago on October the 20th was that the spacecraft underwent what is called a touch and go sampling. And that means that it touched just barely touched the surface of the asteroid. And that's what we're seeing here is that robotic arm reaching out and just tapping the asteroid very gently. And what was done, this was done to collect a sample of the material in the asteroid. So you can see that there's a lot of rocks and gravel associated with this. And in order to collect the sample, instead of scooping it up, which would have been difficult in this maneuver, what was done was to expel nitrogen gas out of a canister and sort of stir up the material down below. And then that pushed the material into the collecting arm, which was then uh, retracted and taken back up. And after just several seconds worth of contact with this portion of the surface of Bennu, the spacecraft then headed back up into orbit around the asteroid and tests were done to make sure a sufficient sample had been collected. And then that is scheduled to come back to Earth in a few years. So it will travel the spacecraft will eventually leave the orbit of Bennu and head back towards Earth scheduled to arrive here in 2023 carrying the sample that it collected two days ago. Now that will give us a chance to study a bit of this asteroid up close. And it is always helpful to have that material here in a laboratory because testing can be done with equipment that could not possibly be taken to the asteroid and also with equipment that may not even exist yet and tests that may not have been thought of when the spacecraft was sent several years ago out to meet with Bennu. So in a few years, we should have that sample of material back here on Earth to be able to study in the laboratory and get a better idea of this asteroid. Now, why do we want to study an asteroid in great detail? Well, asteroids are the building blocks of planets. These are the things that that in much of the solar system combine together to form planets like Earth. So many of them, uh, this are in a way they are the building blocks. These are what built up planets and we're seeing a little bit of that material left over from four and a half billion years ago when the solar system was forming. So here it is unchanged. It is still that primordial material left over from the solar system formation and hopefully will give us a better idea of that material, uh, what it was like before it actually formed into planets and give us a better idea of the origin of our solar system. So that was our picture of the day for October the 22nd of 2020. It was titled Tagging Bennu. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.